Welcome to another episode of The Beast Inside. We're hunting for Wabbit. That top-hatted man who keeps stalking me. He must be somewhere around here. I'm going further away, I think. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Fuck that. That is a cliff. Seriously? When we last left off, we were near the fence, but, uh... There's no way inside, I don't think. This is blocked off, yeah, that's where we last left off. Hoping to find another way around this. Oh my god, I thought that was a hedgehog. And I got jump scared on my own. I need more coffee. I swear to God, guys, the decaf coffee has ruined my life. It doesn't wake me up, but I have to drink it. I am forced to drink it for my well-being, because my nerves are not okay. This is why I play scary games, maybe. Huh, that doesn't lead to anywhere, does it, though? We cannot cross the river. Curious. Hmm. Hmm. Wait a minute. Ninety-six. We are very close. It's here. It's up there, I think. There you are, you son of a bitch. I slipped through here. Time to suck in my gut. Oh wow, I would never have found this otherwise. You said something about his gut. Does he really have a, a gut? I, I don't know. He seemed pretty fit to me. I am pretty fit. How dare you? Do I have a gut? Oh my god, I can't see my legs! Doesn't seem too stable, but maybe I can get to the other side. But maybe this is how we die! I heard my ankle cracking. Is there running? There is running in this game, right? We, we, we can probably make that jump if we run a little closer to the edge of the... Yeah. It's just... Oh my god, are you serious? Yes, I know. I don't need the machinery anymore. I know exactly where to go. This checkpoint, though. Pretty far away. Oh, I'm not allowed to go in unless I scan this thing. I slipped through here. Time to suck in my gut. Suck it up. Let's go. Is this our first death in this game? Have we died before in the video games we've played for Spooktober this year? Yes, I have. I, I have in Observer, I'm pretty sure. Doesn't seem too stable, but maybe I can get to the other side. Ooh. <laughs> yep, running is the way to go. Eh. Fuck, I'm not as fit as I used to be. <laughs> Ten percent. 
Oh, it's further away. So we'll have to take the bridge. Can we open this shortcut for later? Come on, let me move these. <clears throat> Why are these planks so heavy? This is not. This is weird because I'm. I'm pretty sure I'm not allowed to, to move, this crate out of the. Way. Get, get out of my face, please. Are you serious? I cannot pick that. Please go away, thingamajig. Come on, plank. Why did we do that? <laughs> For no apparent reason. It can still now open. Is it pull or push? Does it matter? I don't think it does. Moving along. That is a lot of G's. Um, well... <laughs> Are we following the G stains? Hello? Excuse me, planks. Work with me here. Come on! You serious, Adam? You cannot make that jump? Are you kidding me right now? There you go, good boy. This is a shortcut we will never ever use. Let's explore just a bit. Yeah, we came from that way. When did this game stop being a horror game and now it's an investigation game? Ooh, is that a bird feeder? Cute. He's been feeding the birds! It looks like he hid something in the feeder. Oh god, I've lost him. I'm at the ruined inn. Everything's going according to plan. The inn. Thanks for the tip, dickhead. Turns out we're going there after all. Hold on a moment. I need a, a sip of water. Ah, that's the stuff. I don't see any other clues. He didn't leave anything else behind. Oh. Friendly reminder that you are ruining somebody else's planks. You just broke somebody else's house. Somebody... Uh, probably a kid's treehouse. How do you feel about that, Adam? Tell me. You feel good about yourself? Ruining a child's hopes and dreams? Immersion, most likely? What is that I'm seeing in the distance? Hold on. That a tent? What do we have here? An old tent, some abandoned stuff? Looks like someone just left it all and never came back. But why? A frying pan, useful. Can we not go into the tent? Investigate some more? Oh yeah! Now the question is, am I going the right way? Because I do everything for the sake of exploration. And that is going to bite me in the ass. I'm sorry, what? Oh. The game is saving! Is there more to this place? What's up here? Interesting. There's so many different paths we could take. We can use the machete to uh, get rid of those trees. Well, I could go through here. Huh. 
How long has this poor guy been hanging here? Strange that no one came looking for him. He must have fallen off that poor guy. The backpack is hanging loosely. I think I could knock it off with a stone. What are you expecting me to... Throw rocks? Higher. Oh, I'm not going for the body, I'm going for the backpack. Well, that changes everything. You suck at throwing. Please don't tell your wife. <laughs> Actually, don't tell anybody this happened today. I'm out of rocks. How do I... Thank you, game. Oh my god, it knows I'm a bad thrower. Yay, we got it! Oh no. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't break anything that time. Climbing rope, very sturdy. This should come in handy. This will certainly come in handy. Aren't you going to search the rest of the backpack? That's it? Um, well, <laughs> are we making that jump or what? Fuck! Damn, dude! Still got it. Okay. Now then, which way do we want to go? We don't have a map, so we will have to wing it. There was another path going all the way up. And I think it was this way? Through here. Well, I can't go through there. Never mind that. Maybe we should follow the, uh, the white fence. Not allowed down there. Okay. Alright. Guys, 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 where was the, the path we found? We took a turn here to, uh, look at that tent. And we got the rope. And then... We found a dead end. Excuse me, ooh. I might have to retrace my steps and find the, uh, the signposts. Right. We are going to the inn. I can say I remember where the signposts were from here. Man, this boat looks like it's a hundred years old. Probably more than a hundred years old. How did you make that estimation? Yeah, maybe we don't want to go in there. So that's an interesting find, even though... There's nothing interesting in it. Will I need this? No? Well, what do you know? You might as well pull up a deck chair here and forget all about the Cold War. That's a nice thought. I'm this close to calling this man Ethan, from Resident Evil. I know, he is not Ethan. Okay, Adam, Adam, we got this. I won't forget- oh, oh, signpost! The inn is this way. Perfect. Isn't that where Nicholas went? Wait a minute, what? Didn't we go this way last time? Isn't this how we found the body? No, I took a turn here. I didn't... I didn't keep going. Yeah, 
Is there a motion blur or is it just me? I mean, last time I played I don't remember motion blur, but now motion blur is very, very prominent. For some godforsaken reason, I might have to turn that off. Wait, is it locked off, really? The gate's closed. I need to find another way. Wish I had a lockpick! My thing hasn't bleeped in a while. What do we have here? Some machinery. Old, rusty machinery. Whoa, is this a shaft? <laughs> I said shaft. Oh, wow. Are we using this? That mine shaft looks deep. If I had something that would enable me to climb down it, maybe it'd lead to the inn. Oh no, how, how do I rope? Ah, it's almost automatic. Dude, Adam is ripped. Look at those arms. Game, if you want to throw a scare my way, this is probably the moment. I don't want to spoil it for everybody else, but it's been a while, you know? I kind of miss the spooks. We're not getting that rope back! Echo! Echo! Butts! 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 Thank goodness it's easy to figure out what to do around here. If only Adam could jump on crates! I think that's me, not Adam. There we go. There we go, buddy. There you go. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Oh my god, where are we going? Ah. Oh, I see. <laughs> I simply have no words. What is this jump? My god! Oh, is this how you left your wife pregnant? I, I really want to know. There we go. My god. Oh, is this the inn? Such the ruins of the inn. Wow. This looks like ruins of some big building. What could have happened here? Listen. The uh, motion blur kind of... Why is it on? No. Current scene FPS. Maybe if I turn Vsync on, it's gonna be better? Hopefully. We'll see. Are we alone out here? What the hell is he up to? Yo, buddy! Hey! 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 How the hell are we gonna get in? This place is a dumpster. Did we burn it down in the last memory of Nicholas? You remember the encounter with the, uh, with the judge? I mean, it would make sense if everything was on fire, so I don't know. Is he still there? That used to be a door. Wait a minute, how did I get in? There we go, there we go. Hey! Come back here! country to look like that you have an obsession over the Soviets my dude you should calm down have a Kit Kat or something oh no a, a sneakers a Kit Kat is a different thing 
Oh, the jizz has come back. Oh, lantern! A broken lamp. Could be the reason for the fire that turned the place to ashes. To think that something so small could cause so much damage. Gives me the creeps. We're not allowed to take it, unfortunately. Yeah, this is uh, like the lamp we were carrying as Nicholas before. I think the man wants me to see something. Damn, I'm not really scared of heights, but I better be careful. Don't hide that. We don't need it. Just follow the jizz. A metal rod. It could be used as a lever. Perhaps it could even lift something as heavy as a safe. A safe out here? I highly doubt it. Hold up a second. I'm back here again. Where the hell did the guy go? At this point, I think I'm going in circles. For some godforsaken reason, I'm, I'm uh, able to explore the rooms individually almost, so I'm thinking maybe there's a hidden note or something down here? Something that he wants me to see. Stick the stairs up again. Do I have to make that jump again? Oh boy. Easy peasy! I'm not scared. You're scared. Okay. What do we need to lift? Any of the rubble? What? Who is he? What did he hide here? Now tell me something. How did you know there's a safe in the rubble? Tell me. No, be honest. How did you know there was a safe in the rubble? Unless Adam saw it before I did, and he's being a smart ass. Anyway, what's in this damn safe? How do I open it? Maybe I can find something in this room. It's coded, really? A mystery. I'm ready for it. There we go, it's nice and dark for once. Now, what are we looking for? <laughs> I swear to God, the amount of planks I had to break today to get here. Huh? Can't interact with the drawers, unfortunately. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 what is this? It looks like someone noted the combination to the lock here. Which numbers do I need, though? Remember, the answer is not present. Turn left, turn right. What's the code? Okay, I need uh, to write this down. Wait, what? How 
How the hell am I supposed to make anything out of it? The answer is not present. Are we looking for a number that is not being repeated here? Is there a pattern? So it's one to nine. Oh, and zero as well. We got zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we have to do this for every line. One, two, three. The second row doesn't have a four, so the second one, okay, the second one might be a four. There are several rows where the, the four is not present. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. I can see five. It could be five. For some, some of them the five is there actually or is it wait is there a five at all numbers from the notebook shut up That's adam i'm thinking out. one two three there is not a five i don't see a five so the second one has to be a five okay changing this to five the first one one, two, three, four. Okay, zero is present. One, two, three, four, five. This has to be six. The first one has to be six, right? Or seven. Wait a minute. It's six or seven. Seven, seven, seven. Uh, I don't see a seven on any row. So the first one is seven. The last one, one, two, three, four, five, six. I see a seven everywhere. I see nines, so it has to be six. Oh, wait, I see a six over there. Zero. One, two, three, four, five. Eight and nine present. I see sixes in the last rows. Oh no! Fuck me, man. It's torn! Okay. Forget the last one for now. Let's do the one before last. So we got one, two, three. Wait, we don't have one. This one is definitely one. Uh, this one is the one before last. We have 75 one so far. And the missing page... Some of them will make up a cipher. Let's see. Shut up, Adam. We got zero, we got one, we got two. We don't have threes, we have fours. We don't have fives. We can brute force it. I mean, we can try four to nine, except eight. I don't see sevens either. If I'm correct, we cracked the code. Ooh, it's the buttless angel. Why is there a buttless angel here as well? This angel, I swear to God, is everywhere. Uh, how do I get back to my box? Ah. <laughs> Breaking another plank, of course. Let's see if we did this correctly. I, uh, yes, hello? How do I turn these things? Where, where is my mouse? Oh. It's a tiny little dot, really hard to see. I can see it now, thank you. Seven. Five. One. Mm. 
There, finally. Damn, we're good. The judge tried to strangle me, and he would have succeeded if it wasn't for... Oh, we're moving on to another memory. And he would have succeeded if it wasn't for the man in the top hat and mask. He killed Judge Norton right in front of me. He cut his throat. It looks like he was trying to save me, but why? Christ, I can't do it on my own. There's so much blood. Dear God, is this one of the guests? I don't know. C go get someone. He'll bleed to death. Press on the wound. I'll get help. The janitor is upstairs. Room 207. Where are you? Who is this? Easy. Don't try to get up. Good Lord. No one will ever talk me into a mountain trip again. There he is. Looks like that missing fellow. The detective showed guests his dagger type. Detective? You mean that nosy fop Walter Gilman? Holy mother of God! I have to telegraph the sheriff. No, this man needs a doctor. Uh, I've seen wounds like this. It's only a matter of minutes. I'm sorry, son. These voices... There are so many of them. Wait, wait. I, I think I've heard this conversation before. Those people, they said that a certain detective, Walter Gilman, looked for the judge. If he was interested in missing people from the area, he might know something about my father's disappearance as well. Maybe at the reception desk I can find out his room number. Get to the reception area, gladly. Oh, we found a note. Excuse me, chair. Oh my god, these sofas. I swear to god. Let me in. It's him. Judge John Norton, father's former associate. Is that possible? I've just witnessed a crime from a decade ago? Lost. Memories and delusions. All bleeding into one. Last seen on August 26th, 1854. Here in Blackstone. Walter Gilman. Currently in the Blackstone Inn room number 207. Was it 204 or 207? I'll write them both, okay? The missing judge. Someone has been looking for him. Walter Gilman. More matches. But I don't see any candles to use them on. All these paintings are super dark. I'm locked inside. What a surprise. What a lovely surprise. More matches. Are you kidding me? Where is the good stuff? No good stuff here. It's stuck for good. That's no use. What do you mean it's stuck for good? It's a gun. You mean it's jammed? Maybe he means it's jammed. 106? Is that where we are? Aren't we supposed to go to the second floor? Missing a key for this one. Kerosene, kerosene. Oh, yeah. What was that? Shit. Shit. It gives you one chance to do it right. And then you blow it. And then it takes back all your efforts. All the tries. Yes. 
We're in it to win it. There's a disturbing lack of candles in this room. Why are these locked? Okay, that's a little better. Like, slightly better. What the heck is this? What am I looking at? A lump of pirate from my father's mine. Some call it fool's gold, but it has brought considerable wealth to the Hyde and Whitehead family. <coughs> I'm not a violent man usually, but uh, if you force my hand... What are these sounds? What are these things I'm listening? Okay, I'm kind of glad we are not allowed to move the furniture. Wish I could lockpick those, though. Must be something important in there. Why the hiding? Oh. Oh! We need a key for this one? We cannot lockpick it? Son of a bitch. Let's keep searching the first floor. I am not done here. Why is everything locked? Hmm. Alright, time for the upstairs. Because the rest of the rooms on floor one are blocked off. The game doesn't want me to go there. What the actual shit. We're not going on the second floor, guys. Not through here, we're not. Anything useful? Be quiet now, voices in my head. You're in my head, right? You can't be real. I don't believe in ghosts. I believe in Spooktober. And that's as far as... Oh, creepy. And that's as far as I'm willing to go. Spooktober. Yes, Spooktober is the last straw. Oh, yes. That's what daddy likes. Give me. Now then, we will have to try and go upstairs somehow. I feel like the answer is in the... Ah... Uh, one room we found open. I mean, the one we locked in. <clears throat> here. Must be something important here. I can move. Not the carpet, obviously. Uh -oh. What am I not seeing? Can I shimmy? Oh. Oh. Well, no, we're not going through there. I'm not scared, it's just too dark. This fucking sounds, this ambience, dude. 106, I'm outside 106. I feel like we need to go into 106. Any keys around here? There's gotta be at least one. Come on, baby. Access to the second floor. Damn it. Poopios. More locked doors. What are we not seeing? Hello? Who is having breathing back there? 
Are you okay? Do you have asthma? Can I help you? There's no need to move this. All right, I will use the uh, the lamp for that. Screw it. We have a a lot of uh, oh, 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 open it. Oh, it's empty. God damn it. I need a key or something. What the fuck? That is a painting. Excuse me, madam. Hello? I hear the mutterings of a madman. Well, at least now the game has freaking become horror for once. I cannot do anything with that. I cannot take the map. Cannot interact with it. Cannot push this freaking furniture out of the way. Can I? No. Oh my god, my neighbors are doing something. Uh, next door, and it's extra creepy right now. The ambience. Hing! Yeah! Okay. Nailed it. Go to the reception area. I am at the reception area. Ding! Ding 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 ding! Certainly, I've missed something here. It was the janitor who usually kept the 207. keys in room 207. Someone mentioned it in the memory, so yeah, there we go. Yes, but that didn't solve anything because we didn't get a fucking key for it. Now, did we? The whole place is locked off. Find the janitor's room. Thanks! I've been trying to get in there! How oh, nice. Locked. Not locked. Perfect. Okay. Let's recharge the old lamp with kerosene. Slurp, slurp. Oh god, I have like... 20 of these. Hello? What is going on in there? Are you the janitors? Is that a dead person in there? Who is it? Nope. Nope. <gasps> it's him. I'm not alone. Surely you are, Nicholas, my boy. Oh, we can go in here. Perfect. Okay, um, we will leave that for last. Or maybe we shouldn't... <gasps> I see him! I'm gonna go in here first. Oh, it's well lit. Wow, I'm surprised. Cool. And more matches. Did I miss the spook because I was not carrying the lamp with me? Ah, probably. Was it left here by one of the guests? For nothing is secret that shall not be made manifest, neither anything hid that shall not be known and come abroad. The batless angel is here again, haunting my dreams. Opened all these drawers and probably took the loot with them. Assholes. Okay, not completely. They left me something. Mm, this needs a key. I don't have said key. Kerosene, maybe? I draw the line at 20 kerosene.
If I can find one more, we will light it up. Yeah, baby! Yeah! Off we go then. Back to the proper spooks. Let's find that man. Try this door as well. Oh, it's locked. Well. Okay. We can go upstairs from here. Hopefully. The man went upstairs. I'm gonna go this way! Very sturdy windows. Locked, of course, but... <gasps> More kerosene. You're spoiling me, game. That is too much for me to handle. Is there a limit at how much you can carry at a time? That would make me extremely sad. We're getting so much loot. When am I going to use it all? Oh my god, more kerosene. You gotta be fucking kid. Holy shit, look at this. Oh my lord. I said I was drawing the line at 20. I think we got more than 20 at this point. Holy shit. I'm a happy panda. I'm ready for the next spook. Bring it on. Who is this guy? Whose drawing is this? I mean, the painting. And it's in every freaking horror game with a smiling man. Hello? God, who is this? What is he doing here? Isn't this the guy who killed Norton? We gotta go to 207. Well, I'm there already, but first, we gotta inspect the rest of the rooms. Okay, I'm gonna go here. Fucking hell, what? Oh. Oh! Oh, baby! Oh, yeah! Listen, I'm here for the loot. Oh, and I am being rewarded. Kerosene to the mega! Plus some matches. And Abraham- See, this is the, the, the fat smiling man. Always in horror games. Every single time. Wait, what happened? Did I miss a spook? Again? Oh my god. I can't recall ever doing such a thing. Why would I disturb the guests? I was well aware that if I did something like that, I would get locked up in the dark for days on end. Dear Mr. Hyde, my wife and I had hoped that the week we were to spend at your establishment would be as pleasant and soothing an experience as it was advertised in your brochures. Indeed, the forest provides a calming ambience, and long walks in the crisp mountain air are surely beneficial for the health. Unfortunately, this is all the praise I can offer, and I'm only writing it out of courtesy. Every single night, some deranged brat would haunt the hallways of the inn, running wildly, laughing hysterically, and repeatedly knocking on our door. I tried to scold him multiple times, but he would always manage to run from me or hide somewhere. It was evident that he knew every nook and cranny of the place. The realization came only on the day of our departure when I saw him entering your office. That little bugger wasn't the child of your guests, left unsupervised to pester the other visitors. He was your son. If you can keep your own child in check and you allow him to ruin your guests' long-awaited vacation, you're surely not fit to run an inn. Rest assured that I will relate this outrageous story to all my acquaintances and I'm quite a well-known figure in Providence, and that my wife and I will give your inn a wide berth in the future. A bell. Holy shit. And he said he had no memory of doing such a thing? Oh boy, it's getting spicier as we go. I like it. Why are all the windows locked? Nothing in here. No, 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 no. Close that. Open the other. Boo! Boo! Yes! I think 
that's all. Let's go back to the moaning and screaming and... Oh my goodness. Who let a bird in here? This is outrageous. Oh no, don't, don't light it up again, please. I'm trying to get the matches, thank you. I take one match. I ruin another. Now back to 207 we go, or are we? <laughs> oh, this is 207. Hold up a second, there's something in there. How do we... Rich, it's, it's unlocked, God damn it! How do I get in there? Please let me in. I feel like we will need more kerosene for this. That's more like it. Damn, there's a chain! Ah! This looks sharp. Maybe I could use it to cut through the chain. Excuse me? Are you okay in there? But how do we get in there? Hmm. Do I need to throw stuff at it? No. We gotta find another way around it, I'm suspecting. Oh my, how did I miss this room? Was it... Did I drop something on the floor? Oh, it was a bottle. Huh. Maybe one of these uh, wardrobes is like Narnia. You enter one, you exit in the next room. I sure hope so. Another candle on the floor. Could I be looking for more supplies at this point? We got everything we need for this game and the next. Is that's my guess? Ah, can I enter the fire place? the fuck are you? What was that? Where did it try to drag me? To hell, maybe? Christ, what have I gotten into? Ah, oh, shit. We're back on the first floor again. That sucks. Took me so much effort to get to the second floor. Okay, I will take this with me. Rotate it, please. Rotate it. There we go. I don't really need to hold it. No, you don't! Throw it gently on the floor while I'm picking up things and lighting candles. There we go. Much better. Okay. I, I, I am ready for you. You cannot harm me. The power of Christ compels you. And other entities. Are you here? Oh, more matches. I cannot pick them up with this thing in my hands. Right, right, right. I keep forgetting. Okay, rotate. There we go. Don't drop it, you silly willy! Take so much effort out of me to hold a, a, a single freaking cross. Oh. No, where did my cross go? Shit! Oh no. Oh no. My protection against evil is gone! What am I gonna do? Yoink. What am I gonna do? Where's my cross? Give me back my cross! It's here. Oh, thank God. Come with me. E. E. <laughs> What is happening right now? Oh no, is this a cutscene? Am I not allowed to jump with a cross in my hands? What is this bullshit? Give it back here. I refuse! I cannot jump with a cross in my hands! Oh no! Fine, I, I see how it is. 
Where is that entity? Okay, that's convenient. We are in the room we're supposed to be. Looks like a slaughter. Good God. Something's wrong here. I'd better grab that tool and get out of here. A saw like this can be used to cut through all sorts of metal obstacles, such as chains or padlocks or bones. This should cut through the chain in the janitor's room. I'm not done here. Opal, a magazine for psychiatric patients. A magazine created for the patients of a psychiatric hospital. In many such places, patients cannot even dream about such amenities. They get fed pig's wheel and tied to their beds. Many don't survive their stay, and the ones that do are never really free men again. It should be considered great luck to ever get out of such an institution. How lovely. I want... Collect 10 notes as Nicholas. How about the millions of, of, of the matches and kerosene I've been collecting all throughout the years? I have so many at this point, and I'm a happy man. Or woman, or... I, I, I'm lazy to... Oh shit, I almost fell. <laughs> I won my cross back. <laughs> Is this lit? Okay, it's lit now. Okay, I will take Bob with me. Your, your name is now Bob. Oh. Let's go, Bob. You and me. Fucking hell. The door first. Bob won't let me leave. All right, Bob. You and me, buddy. Let's go. This is it. You open the door. Go. Go on, kid. Open the door. Are you afraid, Bob? Scout ahead for me, okay? It's clear. Thank you, Bob. You're my best friend. Okay. You go in that room. See if there's anyone there. Let me know. And I, I'll, I'll come join you in a bit. I need some extra juice. Oh, it's extremely dark in here without the, the, the lamp. Fuck me. Okay. How is it in there, Bob? All good? Okay, let's go. Again, you go first. I'll follow. But wait. Are you serious? These are locked? Okay, Bob. Back to where we were. Poor soul. He spent most of his life here, and after death, he's still the inn's janitor. But now for eternity. And the guests, from what I can see, are sure to cause trouble. He died as he lived. A janitor. That is sad. What a way to go. Unappreciated. Unloved. Ooh. Ooh. Need more. I want more. Please don't get up and eat my face. I'm not done. Okay, go check on the body, Bob. You do it. I'll be back in a bit. Just <clears throat> clearing up the place. It's nice and quiet. Did we close the door behind? We did not. Is, is there even a door? There's no door. Only pain. I missed the spook because I removed the lantern. Feel sorry for that poor wrench. 
He took to drinking to keep himself sane. I'm afraid I might end up like him if those ghosts don't leave me alone. Mr. Jacob keeps telling me to lay off the bottle. He says that I'm seeing things, but I swear that it's all real. I drink because I'm afraid. Something lurks in these forests. I've heard some inhuman screams in the trees and howling in the caves. I've seen claw marks on the bark. Mr. Jacob says, calm down, you drunkard, you'll scare away the guests. What if they should be afraid? How many people have gone to the forest and never come back? My god, I can hear this howling again. I won't find any rest tonight if I don't take a swig or two. A key for 106. Can be used to access room. Yes, okay. That makes sense. Ah! All right, buddy, what do you have in your drawers? Let me have a, a, a look see here. Oh, they're locked, of course. Um, I got the prompt, but... Um, what about the lady, though, we keep seeing? She doesn't have a top hat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, why, why would you do that? Bob? Oh, my God, where's Bob? Come back. Protect me. Stay in the lookout. Go back into that room. Let me know if you see anything. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. This is it. Huh? Can be used to open wing A? Oh my shell for fucking Is this a ghost? Or did did I completely lose my mind? Okay, that scared the shit out of me. Holy shit, man. <laughs> uh wing A, here we go. Do not open. Dead inside. I want to open. Looks like the janitor had a serious problem with one of his guests. That fucking weirdo wanted to blow me up. I managed to subdue the bastard and lock him up in one of the rooms. May God what's over you if you ever need to enter the B-Wing. The combination in the padlock is anger. Thank you. We have to go in. We have to go that way anyway, because the staircase seems to be <gasps> blocked, or is it? <sighs> Hello? I need more kerosene! I didn't even go to 106, my, my god! Yes, we are on the second floor right now. Why did I do that to myself? Do I have to? Oh, shit. What's in 106? Do we, do we stay upstairs or do we go downstairs first? I don't know. Huh? 
Hello? Please don't attack me. What? Whatever you did. Oh my God! What? What is happening in here? Did we do this for loot? Where was? Where is the guy that was supposed to be here? I hear flies. Well, he's probably dead at this point. Why did we move that? Where am I taking you? Hello, sneaky. Huh. Oh. Thought this was a note. We're not allowed in there. I don't see why we had to move this out of the way. Is there anything in it? No. Okay, I might have to come back to this. Let's go back to 106. Have a look see downstairs first. Can't believe we're still alive! Then again, ghosts cannot hurt me. I can hurt myself though. In we go! I need to take a break. Nothing. Oh, yes. Mm. <laughs> Hello? Maybe I should uh, keep this door closed, just in case. Can you please? Thank you. Whatever I'm looking for is in the wardrobe, isn't it? Looks like a business card of some doctor. Herbert West. Some before the accident at the mine, the relations between my father and his associate became very strained. George was irritable because of the stagnation in their business, and for some reason, he seemed to blame everything on my father or me. I might have been an insufferable brat, I can't deny that, but he kept calling me a lunatic and saw my innocent pastimes as deranged. Is it possible that he had brought a psychiatrist all the way here just to get rid of me? Or maybe it was about some other boy? It was definitely because of you, darling. Not a single question about it. Did we learn all we needed to learn here? Are we supposed to go back upstairs? The game hasn't saved in a while, which makes me think. Oh man, there's so much food I can't. Collect 50 bottles of kerosene. Of course, I've been collecting all of them. Oh my fucking... I called it, didn't I? I fucking called it. Where did she go? I fucking called it. Am I allowed to go now? Was the big wing upstairs or downstairs? Is this the big wing? Who is this lady and why the fuck is she after me? And what is this for? I don't understand. Why did we get this to move out of the way? What? Why it was... It, it was shiny, I swear to God. It'd be nice if I could save my game right about now. I really, really, really need a break. get outside oh I can uh 
Oh, I'm back here again. Shit. Oh, uh, yeah, it's still blocked. Perfect. Okay. Let's take a, a small break. And I will see you all in the next episode of, uh, of The Beast Inside. Until then, thank you everybody for watching. Have fun, whatever you do. Take care of yourselves. And do not forget, keep on the gaming. And we'll see you all next time.